Magic weather in the Magic City. 80 degrees in Miami, Florida today. Pretty good breeze blowing 10 to 15 miles an hour from the team defending the goal on the right. It'll be even hotter, though, down at the base of the Orange Bowl. And the roar in the background, the Miami Dolphins have just come on the field. Rick Weaver, Henry Barrow, back at the Orange Bowl in Miami. The winner of this ball game against the uh, Minnesota Vikings on January the 13th in Super Bowl VIII from Houston. Minnesota defeated Dallas today 27-10. to And should the Dolphins prevail, we will broadcast it for you exclusively in the South Florida area, 3.20 airtime on January the 13th. Are the Dolphins, the fans set up the 10. Charlie Lee will be deep down the near side. Number 23, Mercury Morris, number 22, off to the far side of the field. Guy waiting for the whistle, prepares to get the tone of the ball. Here he comes forward. He slams it. It is a low trajectory kick. It'll be grabbed by one of the short men. The 20, 25, Don Nottingham. 30, up across the 30 to the 36. Don Nottingham and the Dolphins blocking wedge grabs a swiver and returns it some 16 yards, and so the Dolphins come up with a first down at their 36-yard line. The tackle by Bob Hudson and Marty Johnson on the Raiders' special team. I don't know if that was on purpose or not, but Guy was having an awful lot of trouble in his practice kicks before the game. He couldn't get him straight, he couldn't get him long. All right, Gracie brings his ball club out. First down, Miami. From the Dolphins, 36, moving from our left to our right. Two wide receivers to the far side. Warfield is the outside man. Morris and Zonka are the split backs. Behind Greasy, here comes Briscoe in motion back to the near side of the field. A handoff to Zonka, finds the right side and gets only a yard to the 37-yard line. This is the best uh, defense against the rush in the American Football Conference and is the best against the rush only outside of the Minnesota Vikings in the NFL. Less than 100 yards per game are the Raiders permitting, and the Dolphins are going to have to be able to establish the running game in order to be effective. Tony Klein, Art Toms made the tackle on Zonka. A gain of a yard, it'll be a second down and nine. The ball at the uh, Dolphins 37-yard line. Briscoe sets wide to the far side, and Warfield is a slot man to the left. Morris and Zonka, the split backs in behind Greasy. Second down and nine for Miami. Dolphins from their 37-yard line. Long count at the line of scrimmage for Greasy. Somebody jumps from the Raiders, gets back. Here's Morris outside. Holds the tackle at the 40. He's up to the 44 to the 45-yard line before he's knocked off his feet. Mercury Morris, backed up by Jack Tatum and Phil Villapiano. But he hurdled the blockers at the line of scrimmage, and that is what allowed him to get additional yardage. The ball has moved out to the 44-yard line. That uh, is about two yards shy of what they need for a first down, a gain of seven for Morris, and it'll bring up a third down and two. The backs are split. Greasy sets his ball club, waiting for the snap from center. The ball at the Dolphins, 44. They need to get to the 46 for a first down. Third down, here's the handoff. Zonka, he penetrates the right side. He's got the first down, out to the 47. First down, Dolphins from there, 47 on the snap. Hand off to Merck. Through a hole, left side, 45 down to the uh, Raiders, 42. He loses the football, but the play had already been blown dead. Phil Villapiano, the linebacker, the second-year man, third-year man for Bowling Green, makes the tackle on the play. And they're going to bring the chains in as that's close to a first down again. The ball is at the 42-and-a-half-yard line. The chains being brought in from the near side of the field. Let's see whether they're going to make it or not. They haven't set the uh, lead marker down. First down by the nose of the football. So the Dolphins, Mercury Morris runs for a first down, and the Dolphins have a first down at the Raiders 42-yard line. From the Raider 42-yard line, Greasy has not put the ball up. He's dropping to throw his first pass. Looking down the near side for Briscoe. It is knocked away. A flag goes down at the 30-yard line, and it is going to be holding, defensive holding against the Raiders. This is a five-yard penalty, an automatic first down for the Dolphins. Defensive holding against Oakland. Five-yard penalty, automatic first down for Miami. The ball at the Oakland, 37, first down Miami. Waiting for the snap is Greasy. Hand off to Morris. Stops outside of the near side. He is going to be tossed for a loss at the 38-yard line. Did not get the corner turned. A fine play by the left cornerback, Nemaya Wilson, number 48. A loss of a yard on the play, and the ball is marked back at the uh, Oakland 38-yard line. It'll bring up a second down and 11. Clock moving with 11 minutes, 40 seconds left to go in the first quarter. Greasy waits for the snap. Here it is, hand off the kick, finds a small opening, and it closes in a hurry as he gets to the 37, and that's all. Third down coming up, the ball at the 38-yard line in Oakland Territory. And this is where Greasy likes to throw the ball to either Jim Kick or Jim Mandich. They've got the extra defensive back in now. Skip Thomas, number 26, has come in, expecting a pass. Kick and Zonka are split in behind Greasy. 
The ball from the Oakland 38-yard line. Waiting for the snap is Bob. On the snap, he drops straight back to throw. Sets up. Now he's going to run with the ball to the 35, to the 30, down to the 25, the 20. He might go. He is dropped to the 10-yard line. Bob Gracie. Phil Villapiano brought him down, but the pass protection broke down, and Greasy just tucked the ball under his arm and put it for the far side and runs the ball down to the 11-yard line. It's where they make the uh, forward progress halted. A pickup of 27 yards and a first down at the Oakland 11. That's one of the most demoralizing things for a defense. They have the good pass rush on, they have the receivers covered, and then the quarterback runs the ball for a first down and more. Greasy was a running quarterback, and it still is, apparently. The Briscoe splits to the near side, Warfield to the far side. Morris and Zonk are now with a split back. First down from the 11. Here's the handoff, Zonk. Oh, wait, try. Touchdown, Zonk. Larry Zonk, a hold on the right side, big enough to drive a back truck through. Nobody touched him as he just rambled through 11 yards. Langer, Little, and Evans open up that hole, a tremendous gaping hole. And Zonka squirted through with nobody laying a hand on him from 11 yards out. So the Dolphins drop first blood. And Darrell was in to try the point for placement. As Morrill is in the hole, the officials are conferring among themselves. And now we'll get the ball in play. The Premier will try the point for placement. Didn't take the Dolphins long. And the big play there was that greasy scramble. Here's a snap, set down, the kick is up, and it's good. So the Dolphins draw first flat. 64-yard drive, eight plays. With nine minutes and 47 seconds left to go in the first quarter, Dolphins football action continues from the Orange Bowl with a score of Miami 7, Oakland nothing. And here's Garrett's kickoff. It is high, three yards deep as Davis out to the 5, the 10. He's at the 15 to the 20. He is nailed at the 25-yard line. A fine run back by Clarence Davis. Well, the Raiders will start from their 25-yard line. Setting the Raiders offensively for you. The quarterback, Ken Stabler, number 12. The running back, Smith, number 23, Hubbard, 44. The tight end is Moore, 88. The wide receiver, Siani, 49. Belitnikov, 25. The tackle, Shell and Vela. The guards, Upshaw and Beeler. The center is Otto. Stabler is a left-hander. First down. Here's the handoff. Hubbard, hole right side to the 30, 35. Dragging people with him out to the 39. And Jake Scott, the free safety, makes the tackle. And the Raiders run off their right side to open the uh, ball game. And a first down, 14 yards on the pickup by Hubbard. The Dolphins' rushing defense will have its work cut out for it this afternoon. Wayne Moore, we understand. The Dolphins' starting left tackle sustained a bruised shoulder, but he is available to play. All right, Siani splits to the near side. Boletnikov to the far side. Their first offensive sequence. The Raiders pick up a first down. Have the ball at their 39-yard line. Hand off Charlie Smith. He has hit and dropped at the 41. Really cracked. The ball is at the Raider 41. It's a second down and eight. 8.29 to go in the first quarter. Miami leads 7-0. Siani splits left. Boletnikov far side. Here's a handoff going to Hubbard. He's over to the left side again, and he's stacked up. Third down and five. For the Raiders from their 43, 7.55 to go in the first quarter. Miami leads 7-0. Stabler from his 43, drops to throw his first pass. He sets up, he looks, he fires out on the backfield. Caught by Hubbard at the 50 down in the Dolphins territory at about the 48-yard line. A tackle by middle linebacker Nick Bonacani, but that is good enough for a first down. First down for the Raiders at the Dolphins 49. Here's the handoff, coming to Smith, sweeps to the near side of the field. He shakes one tackler, puts his head down, and rams his way to about the 47, and that's all. They were coming again to the left side. Bonacani, Swift, and Fernandez jammed that up. And they marked the ball at the 47. So it's a gain of two. It'll bring up a second down and eight. Here's the handoff. Connor over the right side, and Smith is stacked up at the 45. Dolphins, Manny Fernandez waiting for that one. Wrapped it up immediately along with the middle linebacker, Nick Bonacani. The ball at the Dolphins, 45. Third down and six. They got to get the ball to the Miami 39. Stabler drops back to throw. Blitz on, pass across the middle, flag goes down, the pass is complete to Siani at the 35, and he gets down to the 34 for a first down, but there is a flag on the play. And it's going to be a holding penalty against the Raiders. Siani's progress carried him down to the 34, 
The ball is marked back at the Oakland 40-yard line following the holding infraction against the Oakland Raiders. That is their second penalty. Third down, 21. The ball at the Raiders 40-yard line. Stabler drops the throw. Sets up, fires out of the backfield. It's caught, but uh, the man who caught it is tackled immediately at the Raiders 46-yard line. It's caught by Charlie Smith and Nick Bonacani really slammed him. At the Raiders 46, the Dolphins defense holds and the Raiders will have to punt. They need a 21, and uh, they say his former progress carried out to the 48, so they picked up only eight. So Ray Guy comes into the ball game to handle the punting chores, the leading kicker in the NFC with a 45.3 average. Jake Scott back as a deep man, Anderson the shallow man. Guy stands at the 31, the line of scrimmage is the Raider 48. Here's the snap. He gets the toe into it, gets it high, not too deep. Scott will grab the football at the 13, gets away from one man, is out to the 15, and flattened out right there. And so the Dolphins will start from their 15-yard line. Timeout on the field, Dolphin football action continues from the Orange Bowl with a score Miami 7, Oakland nothing. The Dolphins will start from their 15-yard line. Wayne Moore is the left tackle. Warfield switched to the far side, Briscoe to the near side. Morris and Zonka to split backs behind Gracie. The Dolphins leading 7-0 with 4.43 left to go in the first quarter. Here's the snap, handoff to Zonk. Finds a hole, 20, up to the 25, out to the 29-yard line. Boom, Larry Zonka. Jack Tatum, the free safety. He hit the right side and then cut back to his left. And that right side of that Dolphin offensive line, Langer, Little, and Evans are just blowing off that football. And you know the amazing thing is that Dan Connors read that play perfectly. Jumped right into the spot where he's supposed to be, but just got wiped out of it. The ball as the Dolphins pick up a first down, 14 yard gain, out to the Miami 29 yard line. Warfield to the far side, Briscoe to the near side. The backs remain the same. Zonka and Morris. Greasy with a long count at the line of scrimmage, hands to Zonk, puts his head down and bangs his way across the right side. Gets out to the 32 yard line. The Dolphins moving from our left to our right, have a 7 0 lead, have a second down and seven. The ball to the Miami 32, three minutes, 33 seconds to play in the first quarter. Here's Greasy, play fake, drops to throw, sets up, is going to get caught. Runs into one of his own blockers, Moore, as Moore was whipped on the play. It was his man that finally dumped Greasy back for a loss. Back at about the 24-yard line. So it'll bring up a third down now at long yardage. The ball is marked back at the 24-yard line in Miami territory. Greasy in the passing uh, department this afternoon is 0 for 1. Waiting for the snap is Greasy. He will uh, hand off on the draw to Zonka. He ran into a, one of his blockers and bangs straight ahead. Gets out to the 25 to the 27. And so the Dolphins will not get a first down out of this, and we'll have to punt. All right, the Raiders stop the Dolphins now for the first time this afternoon, and Seifel will stand back at the 11. The line is from the 27. Here's the snap. He gets the kick out of there. Low trajectory kick. Atkinson grabs it back to the 35. And a track. Holy Toledo, what a tackle. There were three men down. Nottingham, Bannon. They just punched him, along with Mike Colin. There's a timeout on the field. Dolphin football action continues from the Orange Bowl with a score of Miami 7 Oakland nothing. Ready to go with the Raiders. They'll start from their 34-yard line. And Stabler ready to go to work. He has the cross put to the far side. Sienna to the near side. The backs are Hubbard and Smith split in behind him. Hand off to Charlie Smith. Sweep to the right. Cuts back to his left. Big hole in the 40. And he has horse potted across the 40 out to about the... 43-yard line. It'll be about a yard shy of a first down. Second down and a very long yard for a first down for Oakland. The ball at the uh, Raiders 42 and a half. Here's Hubbard over the middle. Big hole. 45-50 and knocked out at the Dolphins 45. Jake Scott again makes the tackle. And they're going to have to start making some adjustments up there in that front line because uh, the Raiders are beginning to blow open big holes in the Dolphins rushing defense. First down Oakland at the Miami 45-yard line. Stabler ready to go to work. Here's the handoff. Davis through a hole in the middle. He has hit and dropped at the 40. Falls forward to the 39. The ball at the Dolphins 39. A second down and four. Stabler hands to Hubbard. Starts outside to his right. Cuts back to his left and booms his way down to the 35-yard line. Perhaps inside the 35. That's going to be close to a first down. Nick Bonacani makes the tackle on the play. And the officials will call a time for a measurement. There is no time left on the clock. And that's the end of the first quarter. Dolphin action continues from the Orange Bowl with the score. Miami 7, Oakland nothing. The winner of this ball game against the uh, Minnesota Vikings on January the 13th in Super Bowl 8 from Houston. Right now, the Dolphins have to contend with this move on the Raiders. Here's the handoff to Davis trying to go to the left side. He doesn't get much. And about two yards, maybe down to the 33-yard line. 
Saber in the ball game has put the ball up uh, two times and completed two for 15 yards. Hubbard has carried four times for 34. Here is Saber back to throw. He's being pursued, fires it out. It is knocked away. Find a fancy play by Lloyd Mumford. And Fernandez almost got to him. He did. He leveled him out after he got the ball away. Stabler, that is. And Mumford covering on the pass reception intended for Belitnikov. Down here on the near sidelines, inside the 25. Knocks the ball away. That'll bring up a third down and nine for the Raiders. The ball up the Dolphins, 34. Third down conversion. One out of three for uh, Stabler this afternoon. Third and nine from the Dolphins, 34. He drops back to throw. Good protection. Fires out to the near side. It is incomplete. Intended for the tight end, Bob Moore, on a uh, curl to the near sideline. The ball was thrown a little bit high. Lloyd Mumford covered on the play. And so, George Blanda will come in and try a field goal. It was Blanda's four field goals that uh, defeated the Dolphins, helped to defeat them out in Berkeley. And George has his longest field goal of the year, a 46-yarder, and that was one of the four that he kicked against the Dolphins out there in September. Ken Stabler will hold. He holds the record for most field goals in this uh, game in a lifetime, 11, and the most field goals in a game, four. 41-yard attempt. Stabler holding. Waiting for the snap. Here it is, set down. The kick is up. It's going to be a little bit short. It is off to the far side. Off to the kicker's left. He didn't hit that ball too well, and so the Dolphins will hold and take over. At their 20-yard line as Blanda misses a 41-yard field goal attempt. It didn't appear from here as if anybody got a hand on the football, but uh, he just didn't hit the ball right. and hit it a little bit high, and it was short. You could tell it was going to be short, and it was off to the kicker's left. So the uh, Raiders, with their one and only scoring opportunity in the ball game, Blanda misses a 41-yard field goal, and the Dolphins will start from their 20, moving from our right to our left here in the second quarter. Bob Greasy, Dolphins from their 20. Dolphins lead 7-0. Here comes Briscoe in motion back to the near side. The pitch to Zonka. Sweep to the right, cuts back to his left. Hurdles the tackler, gets out across the 20. Out to about the 23-yard line. Zonka gets three. Got a second down and about seven. The ball out of the 23-yard uh, line in Dolphins territory. The backs in an eye. Waiting for the snap as Greasy hand off to Mercury Moore. Starts inside, cuts outside of the left, gets to the 25 before he is horse collar. Mercury Morris gets only two, and the Dolphins are not getting the yardage that Shula would want him to get against this rushing, tough rushing defense of the Raiders. Third down and five. Miami's football from their 25-yard line. The Dolphins took the uh, initial drive and scored 64 yards in eight plays. They have been thwarted since that time. Greasy with a third down conversion from the Dolphins' 25-yard line. Waiting for the snap. Bob drops the throw. Quick drop. Fires out to the far corner. It is caught across the 30. And that should be good enough for a first down, depending upon where they mark it. Marlon Briscoe is the receiver. He's across the 30-yard line, out to the 31. And Greasy going on the quick out to Briscoe. He was horse collared immediately by Namaya Wilson. But Miami picks up a first down just across the 30-yard line. We'll call up the 30. Now a kick comes out and Morris comes back in. The Miami offensive backfield. The Dolphins thus far have a total of uh, seven first downs in the ball game to the Oakland Raiders. First down for the Dolphins from their 30-yard line. Briscoe splits far side, Warfield to the near side. Morris and Zonka to split backs behind Greasy. On the snap, hand off to Merck, starts outside of the right, shakes the tackler, cuts back to his left, still trying to find a hole, and he gets only two yards to the 32-yard line. Dolphins lead 7-0, 11 minutes, 15 seconds to play in the first half. Dolphins, second down and eight from their 32-yard line. Greasy ready to go to work. Somebody jumps too soon. The Raiders back to throw Greasy. And the play is blown dead. There will be a penalty coming up, presumably against Oakland. They have the only penalties in the ball game. And now they're going to call it against Miami. Illegal procedure. Horace Jones jumped offside. If anyway, the ball is marked back at the 26-yard line in Dolphins territory. It'll bring up a second down and 14. The Raider defense has uh, made some good adjustments since the Dolphins' initial drive. Miami jumped on top 7-0. Greasy is one for two, only six yards through the air and passing. The ball back of the 26th, Dolphins territory, second down and 14. Briscoe wide to the far side, Warfield to the near side. They haven't been able to get the ball out to Paul today. Greasy looking to the right side, fires across the middle, knocked down by Art Toms at the line of scrimmage, the Raiders' defensive tackle. Third down and 14. For the Dolphins from their 26-yard line. 
We're in the second quarter. Miami leads 7-0. Both wide receivers are split to the near side of the field. Greasy drops back to throw. Sets up, fires across the middle. Warfield's got it. 40. Shakes the tackler. 35. Eludes the tackler at the 50. Shakes off another one who's down in the Raider territory at the 47-yard line. Bill Villapiano saved the touchdown for Oakland. Warfield on that slant across the middle. Greasy hit him with a strike. He bounced off tacklers at the 50-yard line and picked up additional yardage down to the 47, 27 yards on the pass to Gleason, Greasy to Warfield. And that's the first pass Paul has caught against the Raider pass defense this year. And Warfield a bit upset because somebody gave him a forearm uh, and it, it smarted a little bit. It was number 26. Skip Thomas. All right, the Dolphins now with a first down at the Raider 47-yard line. Briscoe wide to the near side. Warfield a slot man to the near side. Now Briscoe in motion back to the far side of the field. Greasy on the snap. Play fakes. Drops the throw. He's firing deep downfield to the near side. Warfield. It is stolen away. Intercepted by Willie Brown. And he runs it out of bounds at the two-yard line. An interception as Brown continued his momentum back down the near sideline and he stepped out of bounds where he caught the ball. Perhaps he couldn't stop his momentum. It was back at about the 15, but he kept running the ball back downfield and runs it out at the Raider 2. So Greasy is intercepted. He was going deep for Warfield and Willie Brown covering Warfield like a blanket intercepted the ball and runs it out of bounds at the Oakland 2-yard line. There is a timeout on the field. Dolphin football continues from the Orange Bowl with a score of Miami 7, Oakland nothing. Rick Weaver, Henry Barrow, back at the Orange Bowl in Miami, following the interception by Willie Brown on the Greasy to Warfield pass. The Raiders have the ball at their two-yard line, a long way away, and bad field position. Stabler has Davis and Hubbard, the running back. Hand off to Hubbard, tries the left side, and he gets to the four, and that's all. The ball is put down at the Oakland four-yard line. They're not having much success over their left side, where they like to run the football, and they have the ball at their four, second down and eight. Running back in the end zone, out to his left. Stabler fires it up, it is dropped at the 15-yard line. The pass was intended for Ciani as uh, Stabler was back in the end zone. It was almost intercepted by Dick Anderson. A third down at eight situation. Thus far, third down conversions for Stabler, one out of three. The ball at the Oakland four-yard line. They have to get the ball out across the 12 to keep this drive alive. Stabler on the snap. Hands off to Hubbard. Over the left side, he gets to the eight, and that's all. So the Dolphins hold the no-name. Hold again. Let's get the handkerchiefs out. Give the no-names a standing ovation. What a uh, defensive structure this has been so far. Bonacani, Bob Hines, stacked up that play. Gray guy will kick. And he will stand uh, about two yards off the baseline of the end zone. Scott is deep. Anderson shallow. The line of scrimmage is the eight. There's the snap. Dolphins put on a good rush. He gets it high out of there. Booms up, beauty. Holy smokes, what a kick. Big Scott fumbles the ball, picks it up back at the Dolphins 30, tries to find a hole, comes back to the near side, gets the block, and it's tossed to the ground across the 35 at the 36-yard line. Scott needed one block, which he didn't get to break up the near side line. A great kick. Gary Weaver makes the tackle on the special team for Oakland. 64-yard punt by Ray Guy at that time. That is not his longest of the year. His longest is 72. So the Dolphins, uh, with a timeout on the field, Dolphin football action continues from the Orange Bowl with a score of Miami 7, the Raiders nothing. Ready to go to work, Greasy. Dolphins from their 37-yard line. Morris and Zonka, the Ibacks, in behind Bob. Here's a handoff. Mercury finds a small opening on the left side and does not get very much out to the 39. Greasy ready to go to work now. Second down and eight. The ball at the Dolphins' 39-yard line. The backs are in an eye, waiting for the snap. Here's Greasy, here's the handoff, Morris over the right side, finds a hole, squirts through across the 45. Out to the 46-yard line, and perhaps closer to the 47. A third down and a yard. The ball at the 46-yard line, we'll call it, in Miami territory. Kick and Zonka, the split back, send behind Greasy. The ball at the Dolphins, 46. Waiting for the snap, here it is to Zonk over the left side, cuts back to his right, he's got the first down out to the 50-yard line. Larry Zonka, good hole over the left side. Dolphins first down from the midfield strike. Miami leads 7-0, six minutes to play in the first half. Willie comes in motion back to the near side. Hand off to Zonka, trap over the right side. He gets down to about the 47. Zonka, blasting over the right side. Filipiano, the left side linebacker, along with middle linebacker Dan Connors, in on the stop. A second down as they mark the ball at the 48. It will bring up a second down and eight. Five minutes, 30 seconds to go in the first half. Willie splits off the far side. Warfield on the near side. 
Morris and Zonka to split back behind Greasy. The ball at the Oakland 48-yard line. Greasy waits for the snap from center. Here it is. Play fake. Drops to throw. He's setting up, firing across the middle, and it's knocked down. A flag goes down on the far side of the field. A flag goes down over there as Twilley was bumped into by two men. He was not the intended receiver. There's also a flag down back at the 44-yard line. That's what they are, offsetting penalties, and so they'll run the play off again. Second and eight from the Oakland 48-yard line. Connor Trapp, knock a big hole right side, 45, 40, down to the 35, down to the 34-yard line. Goes Larry Zonka. Jack Tatum brought him down, but he got a free ride for about three yards as Zonka had a gaping hole across the right side that often picked up a first down at the Oakland 34. And a great counter trap blocking off the right side, and Marv Fleming, the tight end, really hit somebody, and Evans, along with the guard. The ball is at the Raiders' 34-yard line. Greasy thus far on third down conversions is having a good afternoon, five out of six. First down Miami at the Raiders 34-yard line. This drive consuming about three and a half to four minutes thus far. Here's the handoff. Morris starts inside, cuts outside of his left 30, down to the 25, down to the 23-yard line. Rambles Mercury Morris. Willie Brown, the right quarterback, had to make the tackle on the play. And that's good for another Miami first down. He started inside, cut outside, found a hole. And picks up a first down to the Oakland 23-yard line. The Dolphins are not supposed to be able to run. At least most teams have it against the Raiders all season, but the Dolphins are getting a fine performance out of that offensive line. We have word now that Marlon Briscoe is okay and can play. Still no report on Bill Stanfield. Bully splits to the far side. To the near side is Warfield. First down Miami from the Raiders 23. Morris and Zonka split in behind Greasy. Waiting for the snap is Bob. Here's the handoff. Zonka, hole right side, 20, down to the 16. They are just blowing the Raiders off that football. The ball is put down at the Raiders' 16-yard line. It'll be a second down and three. Three minutes, 12 seconds to go in the half. Dolphins lead 7 to nothing. trying to get another one. Handoff, Zonka, hole, he's got the first down over the right side, down to about the 12. Larry Zonka gets the uh, first down again. The Dolphins just chewing up the clock, chewing up yardage. Two minutes, 30 seconds to go in the first half. Dolphins first down at the Raider 12-yard line. Typical greasy, time-consuming drive. Warfield splits near side of the far side is fully. The backs are in and eye. First down from the Raider 12-yard line. Moving toward the west end. Morris finds an opening. Squirts through down to about the seven. That's the two-minute warning. Dolphin football continues from the Orange Bowl with a score Miami 7, Oakland nothing. Rick Weaver, Henry Barrow back at the Orange Bowl in Miami. The Dolphins have a second down and five situation at the Raiders' seven-yard line with two minutes to go in the first half. Miami leads 7 to nothing. Word is that the Dolphins have 140 yards on the ground uh, thus far in the first half against this Raider rushing defense, which averaged on the season allowing just some 95 to 96 yards per ball game against all opponents. So this is an achievement that Monty Clark and Shula really have to be proud of, and certainly that offensive line. In order to get the job done against this team, you have to be able, have to, be able to run, and the Dolphins' offensive line has controlled that line of scrimmage. All right, a second down and five. The ball at the seven-yard line. Morris and Zonka, the splitbacks, in behind Greasy. Five at the line of scrimmage, waits for that snap from center, Jim Langer. On the snap, hands to Zonk over the right side. He's down close to the first down. He gets down to about the three-yard line. Third down and one from the three-yard line. On the snap, handoff to Zonka over the right side. He's down to the two, and that's going to be close to a first down. Perhaps inside the two. All he had to do was get inside the two-yard line for a first down. And the officials are going to call a timeout for a measurement. It's fourth down and a foot. The ball at the two-yard line, and the Dolphins are going to go for it. Bob waits for the snap. Still waiting. Hand off to Zonka over the right side. He's got the first down and uh, close to the end zone. He's down at the one-yard line. 34 seconds to go before the end of the half. We're down here at the west end of the field. Bob sets the ball club waiting for the snap. Here's the handoff. Kick is stacked up and he might have lost the yard. They were waiting for him. He was really creamed at the two-yard line. 27 seconds on the board. Remaining in the first half. Ready to go. The ball at the Raider two-yard line is second and goal from that position. The backs are split in behind Greasy. The two tight ends remain in. Here's Greasy spinning out to his right. Crosses across the middle. It is deflected in the air and it's incomplete. Bring up a third down and goal from the two. The incompletion stops the clock with 20 seconds to go in the half. 
Here's the big play now for the Dolphins to try to get a touchdown on this drive. They put the play to the far side, Warfield to the near side. The back kick and Bronco in an eye. Third and goal from the Raider two-yard line. Greasy up under center, waits for the snap. Here it is. Zonka! Trap play, touchdown! a great bit of play faking handed to Zonka the quick trap in the middle and he booms over right guard Larry Little just opened the hole and Zonka gets his second touchdown of the Dolphins lead 15 to nothing and Zonka hugging Larry Little uh, he knows where the credit for that touchdown goes Little just creamed Dan Connor he just knocked him flat to open that hole and Zonka just falls it into the end zone so Garrow is in to try the point from placement. The clock shows 17 seconds left to play in the first half. And that drive, what a time-consuming drive that was. Dolphins now lead 13 to nothing. Morrow will hold as Yepremian tries the point. Snap set down, the kick is up, and it's good. 14 to nothing ball game. Little is limping as he comes off the field. So the Dolphins complete a 63-yard drive in 16 plays. Absolutely unbelievable. The big play in the drive was Bronco's 14-yard run, and he also scores on a two-yard touchdown plunge. So the Raiders find themselves now looking down a 14-0 lead with just 17 seconds left to go in the half. And they will have some adjustments to make, I'm sure, particularly on defense. Against the way the Dolphins have controlled the line of scrimmage. Clarence Davis, Charlie Smith are back as the deep men to receive the kickoff from Garrow Yepremian. Smith is deep off to the far side and Davis down to the near side. Yepremian will kick off. 17 seconds left to go in the half. Dolphins lead 14 to nothing. Here is the kickoff. He gets it high and it's going to be back in the end zone. Grabbed by Davis and he will down it back there. There'll be no run back. Stabler from the 20-yard line, hands off, and the ball carrier is stacked up at the 22-yard line. Clarence Davis trying to penetrate the middle. He did for two, and that's all. As Manny Fernandez, who has done just a tremendous job on defense since coming back from that muscle pull, makes the tackle. There is no time left in the first half. The Dolphins executing perfectly. That's the end of the first half of the score. Miami 14. The Raiders nothing. Darrell will kick off, and Charlie Smith, number 23, will be deep off to the far side, and Clarence Davis, number 28, deep down the near side. The Dolphins will be defending the East goal to our right for this third quarter. Dolphins lead 14 to nothing. On two long, sustained drives, Zonka has scored both touchdowns. Let's see what the adjustments have been on both teams for the second half. Darrell, waiting for the official's whistle, comes forward, gets the toe into the ball, gets it high. It is not deep. Smith will take it up the two. We'll run it out the five. Straight ahead of the ten. The fifteen. Across the twenty in his horse collar. At the twenty-two yard line. Twenty-one yard return as they mark the ball at the twenty-three yard line. The Raiders start from there. Saber, the quarterback, has Smith and Hubbard as the running back. Here's Hubbard over the right side. Puts his head down and rams his way out across the twenty-five to the twenty-seven. Nick Bonacani. The Dolphins' middle linebacker made the tackle on the play. The ball is at the 27-yard line, a four-yard pickup, a second down and six. The Litnikoff split to the near side. Here's Stabler, sprinting out to his left, looking to throw up the far side of the field. Throws back across the middle, completed the 35-yard line, out to the 36. First down, Oakland at the Raiders' 36-yard line. Dolphins lead 14 to nothing, 13 minutes, 40 seconds to play in period number three. The play fakes, he drops the throw. Fires deep across the middle, it is overthrown and complete intended for more the tight end but that ball was really off target and catching it on first bounce was dick anderson brings up a second down and 10. the ball at the oakland 36 yard line back to throw goes stabler has time fires out to the far side flag goes down and the pass is caught and out of bounds at the 43 yard line doug swift makes the tackle but there's a flag on the play and we're going to get a personal foul against miami Art Shell, the very fine offensive left tackle for the Raiders, is injured. The penalty, personal foul against the Dolphins, puts the ball at the Miami 43-yard line, and the Raiders have a first down. Their deepest penetration of the day has been to the Miami 34. Here's a handoff, Hubbard over the left side. He is inside the 35, down to about the 32-yard line. Bob Matheson makes the tackle on the play. 
First down for Oakland as they have made their deepest penetration of the day to the Miami 32-yard line. It's in motion, Bolitnikoff, here's the handoff, Smith sweet to the right side, cuts back to his left. He is inside the 30, down to the 28, and that's all. Gain of four, it'll bring up a second down and six. 12 minutes, 10 seconds to play in the third quarter. Stabler, hands off, Smith, the whole left side to the 25, and he's dragged out from behind, or he would have found daylight at the 24-yard line. Third down and two, Stabler back to throw from the 24, deep drop, has time, fires it, it is caught, and dropped at the 20-yard line immediately after he caught the ball as Hubbard, but he gets the first down. Tackled by Doug Swift. Now the Dolphins' defense will have to stiffen. First down, Raiders. At the 20, Hubbard in motion off to the far side. Stabler hands to Smith, starts outside to his left. Does he get the corner turn? He does, and he is belted out of bounds at about the 14-yard line. So this is the most serious threat of the day now for Oakland. The ball is at the 14-yard line. A second down and four. Stabler ready to go to work from the 14, second and four. Connor over the right side, and no yardage gained by Charlie Smith. He has stacked up at the line of scrimmage. The Dolphins, Bill Stanfill and Nick Bonacani waiting for that one. That'll bring up a third down and four. Thus far in the ball game, third down conversions for Ken Stabler. Two out of five. And this is a big one right here with 10 minutes, 10 seconds to play in the third quarter. Stabler drops the throw. Has time. He fires. It is almost intercepted at the seven-yard line by Lloyd Mumford. The pass went right through the hand of the intended receiver, Fred Bolitnikoff. It appeared to be on target right through his hands. And Mumford had to trap the ball on the ground or he would have had an interception. So that brings up a fourth down, and Blanda will come in and try his second field goal attempt on the ball game. On the season, he was 23 out of 33, and he has missed one from 41 yards in this ball game. This will be a 21-yard attempt. Ken Stabler will hold down here at the east end. It's from the near side inbounds hash mark. George, of course, the straight-in kicker. Snap, set down, the kick is up. And this time it's good. Landa with a 21-yard uh, field goal, and the Raiders finally get on the board with 9 minutes and 49 seconds left to play in this third quarter. There's a timeout on the field. Dolphin football continues from the Orange Bowl with a score of Miami 14, Oakland 3. Rick Weaver at the Orange Bowl. The Dolphins now lead 14-3 following Blanda's 21-yard field goal. Here's Guy's kickoff. It is not uh, deep. There'll be a run back. Charlie Lee at the 4, 5, 10 to the 15 to the 20. Cuts for the near side. He's got a hole. 30, 35, 40, 45. Cut back to his right. 50's out of the 45, out of bounds at the open 43-yard line. Ray Guy, the kicker, ran him out. Fifty-three yard kickoff return by Charlie Lee. And that's the way to come back. Charlie Lee grabbed that ball at the four yard line, found a hole off the near side, sprinted up the near side line, cut back to his right at the 50, and was dropped by Guy, the kicker, or he would have gone all the way, and the Dolphins have excellent field position at the Oakland 43. All right, Twilly's foot's far side. Warfield is a slot man to the far side. The backs are Kick and Zonka from the Oakland 43. Zonka over the right side, dragging people with him inside the 40, down to the right of 39-yard line. Booms Larry Zonka. Waiting for the snap is Bob Greasy. Here's the handoff. Kick through a hole right side. Booms his way down to the 36-yard line. Jim Kick behind Larry Zonka and Larry Little. Rambles down to about the 36-yard line. That'll be about three yards shy of what they need for a first down. That Raider drive, 64 yards, 11 plays. And they had to settle for George Blanda, 21-yard field goal. Greasy with a third and three from the Raiders' 36-yard line. Waiting for the snap is Bob. Somebody jumps from the Raiders, gets back in time. Here's the out pattern. Caught by Twilly. He is going to be run out of bounds. Checked by Jim Kick. Filipiano made the tackle. No gain on the play. They're going to mark it at the 35, so give him a gain of a yard. That's where they finally mark it. It's not enough for a first down, and the uh, Darrow is going to come in to try a field goal. Snap, set down. The kick is up. He's got the distance. It's gone. Field goal. Oh, 7.27 to play in the third quarter. Dolphins lead 17 to 3. Charlie Smith, number 23, deep off to the far side, down at the west end. Clarence Davis, 28 down the near side. A big play in that drive was a magnificent 53 yard kickoff returned by Charlie Lee. Here's Darrow's kickoff. He gets it high. Back into the end zone is Davis, two yards deep, up to the 5, the 10, the 15, and he is back at the 20 yard line. Holy Toledo was he sandwiched. There's a handoff. Smith. Cutting back to his left as he penetrated a hole on the right side. Booms his way out to about the 27-yard line. Bob Matheson 
makes the tackle on the play for Miami, along with Nick Bonacani. Gain of some six yards. Second down and four for Oakland. The ball at the 27-yard line in Raider territory. Smith and Hubbard remain the running backs behind Stabler. He will sprint out to his left. Great block, sprints to his left. He fires across, back across the green again. At the 34, it is caught and knocked down as Blitnikoff at the 34. That's good for a first down. First down, Raiders from their 34. Clock moving with six minutes, eight seconds to go in the third quarter. Dolphins lead 17 to three. Waiting for the snap is Stabler as Siani comes in motion back to the near side of the field. Here's the handoff going to Davis. Starts outside to his left, cuts back to his right, and is hit and dropped at the 40-yard line. Second down and four for the Raiders. The ball at their 40-yard line. Bab in replacing Scott. Back to throw. Deep drop. Stabler, good protection. Fires across the middle, and it is caught at the Raider 46 and dropped immediately is Clarence Davis, Bonacani, and Cullen make the tackle on the play. That is good for a first down. Scott shaking up uh, down on the sidelines, taking a little oxygen. And Dr. Virgin gave him a whip of the smelling salts. Davis and Pete Banizak now the running backs. Siani, Bolitnikov split to the near side. Stabler, first down, back to throw. Fires out, caught at the 49. A football! The Dolphins have it! It is picked up! And it's going to be blown dead. Now let's see if they roll it an incomplete pass. And that's what they do. That Davis, Davis was the receiver. And he was hit, dropped the ball. And uh, Dick Anderson, Mike Cullen, picked the ball up. But the officials ruled that it was an incomplete forward pass. That's a bad call. Stabler now has hit 7 out of 12 for 48 yards. That's an official's judgment call, whether he had possession of the football or not. And it appeared from here, and it appeared to everybody, of course, the partisan Dolphin fans, that he didn't have possession of the ball. They rule it an incomplete pass, second down and ten. Fifth branch, Mike Ciani are now the wide receivers. Ciani splits far side, branch to the near side. Davis and Banizak are the backs in behind Stabler. From the Oakland 46, Stabler back to throw. He's going to have to scramble, gets away from one tackler, fires. Back at the 50-yard line, Ciani is a run out of bounds. Down in the Dolphins territory after a great effort. Down at about the Miami 46. That will not be enough for a first down. Charlie Babb ran him out. The ball at the Dolphins 46, third down and two. Mike Ciani, wide receiver to the far side. To the near side is Branch. The fans still blowing the official's call on that alleged recovered fumble. Third and two for the Dolphins 46. Stabler with a deep drop. Sets up. He fires, it is knocked down, and a flag on the play, several flags, and we may be going to get pass interference against the Dolphins. Nick Baldacani trying to cover Banasak on the play. There are a couple of flags. Pass interference against the Dolphins. That is an automatic first down. That is an automatic first down. Uh, Jake Scott, we understand, is available to play. And here he comes back on the field. Heinz goes out. Matheson comes in. First down for the Raiders at the Dolphins 40 following that pass interference call. Four minutes, 14 seconds to play in the third quarter. Dolphins lead 17 to 3. The fans are still setting up a howl over that uh, alleged bad call by the officials on the completed pass and the fumble. Stabler dropping the throw. He has time. He is firing deep down in the far corner. Man down there. It is knocked away. In the end zone, the pass was intended for Cliff Branch. And a great bit of coverage by the Dolphins. Curtis Johnson was the man who was uh, making the deep drop and took the ball away at the last moment as Branch, has tremendous speed at 9-2 in the 100, was down there, but uh, Curtis played it uh, perfectly. Curtis didn't look very slow on that play himself. Second down and 10. For the Raiders, the ball at the Dolphins' 40-yard line. The clock is stopped on the incompletion with 4.07 to go in the third period. Miami leads 17-3. Stabler having to put the ball upstairs now. Politnikoff is split off the far side. And they have both receivers split to the far side of the field. There is Stabler dropping deep again. Has time. Now sprinting out to his right. Being pursued. Fires the ball. It is caught at the 30 and down inside. The Dolphins' 30 for the 29. The 28-yard line is Mike Ciani. First down, Raiders at the Dolphin 28-yard line. On the snap, handoff to Banizak. Over the left side, he has hit and dropped right at the 25-yard line. Bolitnikoff, Siani both splits to the near side. The backs remain the same. Second down and seventh, the Dolphins 25. Stabler, deep drop. Has all day, firing deep down the near corner. Man, wide open. Touchdown, Oakland. 
As the Dolphins pass defense, Dick Anderson was badly beaten on the play. Mike Ciani wide open. I have never seen a man so wide open in my life. As Stabler, Ciani was wide, smack dab open, and it's now a 17-9 ball game. As Stabler throws a touchdown pass to Ciani, and Dick Anderson was the nearest man to him, and he was a good 8 to 10 yards away. That's about as badly beaten as you'll ever see the Dolphin pass defense. And that's the sixth touchdown pass given up by the Dolphins' pass defense, the best in the league on this campaign. Blanda will try the point from placement. Stabler will hold with 2.39 to go in the third quarter. Snap, set down, a kick is up, and it is good. So now it is a 17-10 ball game with the uh, Dolphins out in front as Stabler completes that touchdown pass to Ciani. It was wide open and puts them right back in the ball game. Dolphin football continues from the Orange Bowl with a score of Miami 17, the Raiders 10. I think probably that was Lloyd Mumford's man, uh, Ciani, and Anderson just happened to be near the play that uh, caused it to appear that Dick was beaten on the play, but uh, he probably was just trying to cover. Here's the kickoff. A yard deep. Morris has it. Out to the 5, the 10, the 15, and he's going to be contained at about the 18-yard line. Mercury Morris. Oh, that touchdown pass, 25 yards from Stabler to Ciani, a 79-yard drive and 12 plays as the Dolphins were badly beaten on pass defense. First and 10, Miami from their 18-yard line. Morris and Zonka, the Ibacks. Here's a handoff to Merck over the right side, and he gets out across the 20 to about the 21-yard line. Clock moving with 2.13 to go in the third quarter. The Raiders on that touchdown pass find themselves right back in it. The Dolphins lead 17-10, to 10, a second down at 8. Miami's ball at their 20-yard line. On the snap, here's Morris, cuts outside to the left. He's got a first down to the 25 to the 30, out across the 30 to the 33-yard line. Mercury Morris, good blocking off the left side. Bill Villapiano has done a dandy job at that linebacker spot, made a lot of tackles for the Raiders this afternoon. Coming across, makes the stop again. They're going to mark the ball at the, we'll call it the 33. From the 33, here is Zonka Hall, right side, 35, out to the 40-yard line as they run the tackles again. Clock moving with 49 seconds to play in the third quarter. A second down and a long three from the Dolphins' 40-yard line. Both receivers split to the near side of the field. The handoff, Morris over the right side, digging and driving and bucking his way. And they set the ball down at the Miami 42. It'll bring up third down and a little bit less than a yard. Clock moving with five seconds. They will not get another playoff here before the end of the third period. And there is no time left to play in... The third quarter, that's the end of the third period. Dolphin football action will continue from the Orange Bowl with a score, Miami 17, the Raiders 10. Dolphins have two tight ends, Fleming and Mandy Chin, to assist with the blocking or the drive for this first down up front. The Dolphins lead 17 to 10. Kick and Zonka the back. Here's Zonka. Big hole, 45, 50. Down in the Raiders territory at the 48-yard line. Larry Zonka gets more than the first down. Now that's going to happen when you stack everybody up on the line. As soon as one of our offensive linemen makes his block, and everybody stacked up there. That gives running room behind the line of scrimmage, and that's just what the Zonks found. Jack Tatum made the tackle from his free safety spot. The Dolphins' offensive line continuing to control that line of scrimmage, and that's what it's going to take for the rest of this ball game to uh, prevail. Morris is in. Zonka and Morris are the back. Warfield puts to the far side. Paul has been thrown to a couple of times this afternoon and has one reception. Trilly is the wide receiver to the near side. Marlon Briscoe sucking oxygen down on the uh, Dolphins' bench. There's a handoff coming to Zonk. He comes around the right side and gets back to the line of scrimmage, and that's all. Second down and 10 for Miami. The ball at the Raiders' 48-yard line. Waiting for the snap is Bob. Here it is. Hands off on the trap. Zonka finds a hole. Squirts through down to the 45. Villa Piano and Bubba Smith in on the tackle. Gain of three yards on that last play. Zonka unofficially now is over 100 yards. He has 101. The ball at the 45 in Raiders' territory. Third down and seven. Greasy on third down conversion is 8 out of 10. And this is a big one right here. With the Dolphins leading by only 7, 12.45 to go. They've got to get uh, just outside the Raiders 38 for a first down. Greasy, quick drop. Now he's going to scramble. Quarterback draw got the first down to the 35. Down to the 30, down to the 27-yard line. Bob Greasy, tackled by Art Tom. And that was a planned play. Greasy, who earlier in the ball game was forced to run, ran for 27. This time... A designed quarterback draw, and he gets down to the 28-yard line. Irv Goody has now replaced Larry Little at right guard for Miami. 
Bob Greasy runs for the first down of the Raiders 28 yard line. That's for Greasy. Ninth to check at 17 yards. It's just an equipment repair for Larry Little. No injury. Ball at the 28 yard line in Raider territory. Greasy going for 17. Here's Zonk up. Big hole. 25 20. Down inside the 20 to the 18 yard line. Zonk over the left side. Jack Tatum again makes the stop. And that was Irv Goody that opened that hole up for the Zonk. Jim Kick comes out, and Mercury Morris comes in at a running back. Kuchenberg, Langer, Little are the interior of that offensive line. Ball at the 18-yard line of Raider territory. A second down to one for a first down. The Dolphins on the march again, leading 17 to 10. 11 minutes, 22 seconds left to play in the ball game. Warfield splits to the far side. To the near side is Howard Twilley. Morris and Zaka the split backs on second down and one from the Oakland 18-yard line. Waiting for the snap. Greasy hands to Zonka. Threads his way through the left side. Fumble! Who's got it? At the 21-22 yard line, Miami gets the ball. Miami comes up. The ball was knocked right out of, of Zonka's hands. As you recall, in the earlier ball game, Zonka fumbled and stopped the drive against the Raiders, which was recovered by Oakland. But that time, Miami comes up with it, and Mercury Morris is the man who recovers the ball. The Dolphins lose yardage back to the Oakland uh, 21 is where they mark it. And instead of a second down and one, Burke comes out. After recovering the fumble, it'll be a third down and three. So Greasy, who has converted on nine out of 11 third down situations this afternoon, has another one here. Third down and three. 10.40 to go. Dolphins lead 17 to 10. Warfield splits left. Twilly to the near side. Dolphins moving from my left to our right. Kick and Zonka to split back behind Greasy. They've got to get to the 18 to keep this drive alive. There's a handoff. Zonka over the left side, and he is digging for that yardage. It's going to be awfully, awfully close. He gets down to about the 18-yard line, and that's going to, as he hit the left side, going to be very, very close. Apparently, the Dolphin bench figures he did not make it, so here comes Garrow's field goal team on. This will be a 20. Morrill will hold the ball at about the 26 down here at the east end. Here's the snap. Set down. The kick is up. He's got the distance. It's gone! Jepremian with his second field goal of the afternoon. And it is now a 20 to 10 ball game. With the Dolphins out in front, nine minutes and 42 seconds left to play in this contest. Timeout on the field. Dolphin football action continues from the Orange Bowl. The score, Miami 20, the Raiders 10. That drive, 63 yards, 12 plays. Your premium in a 26-yard field goal. Garrow tees it up. He will kick to either Charlie Smith down the near side or Clarence Davis off to the far side. The fans setting up that number one chant a little bit early. 9.42 to go. The 10-point lead. Here is the high kick. It is uh, not too deep. Fumble, however, out in the field of play. Picked up at the six. And Davis gets out to about the 12-yard line. Davis fumbled the ball about two yards deep in the end zone. It bounced off his chest. Had to came back out in the field of play and he had to field it. The fans now set up the chant defense defense and this is what the Dolphins need. Stabler is the quarterback. Siani and Bolitnikoff the wide receiver. Stabler back to throw. Pass is caught out of the backfield. Smith across the 20 and he has belted out of bounds on the near side at the 25. Dick Anderson ran him out. Ball at the 26 yard line. 14 yard pickup. Raiders with the football first down at their 26. Stabler back to throw. Sets up, fires out to the near side. It is caught at the 30 and out of bounds is the tight end Bob Moore. Immediately a gain of four yards on the play. Eight minutes, 45 seconds to play as the clock is stopped. From there, 30. Here's a drop play. Hubbard of the right side. He gets only two yards out to the 32-yard line. Now, here's the big play of the ball game thus far for Oakland. Third and four from their 32-yard line. On the snap, he drops the throw. He fires across the middle. It is caught by Charlie Smith at the 36 and that might be enough for a first down Mike Cullen is the man who made the tackle on the play and it appears from here as if he did pick up enough for a first down without a measurement first down for the Raiders in their own territory clock moving with 739 to go this time he will run the ball and upended after a gain of only a yard up to about the 37 yard line they mark it at the 37 yard line and bring up the second down and Nine. Clock moving with 7.05 to go. The Dolphins lead 20 to 10. This has been a rib cracking contest. Belitnikoff and Siani both split to the near side. Back to throw is Stabler. Uh, here's the pass across the middle. It is caught at the 40, up to the 45, and knocked down right there is Belitnikoff. 
third down and one. The ball at the Raiders 45. Clock moving with six minutes, 30 seconds to go. Dolphins lead 20 to 10. Waiting for the snap. Stabler hands off. Vanisak hits the right side, and that's going to be very close. I don't know whether he made it or not. They missed it by about six inches with a fourth down, and they almost have to go for this with six minutes, 21 seconds to go. Fourth down, about six inches to go for a Raider first down at their own 46-yard line. Tyler and Moore stay in. Tyler is normally a tackle. He is playing at a tight end. They put Hubbard back in now. Hubbard and Smith, the running back. They split Siani to the near side. Fourth and inches from the Raiders' six yard, or 46 yard line. On the snap, here's a handoff. Fumble! Picked up by Stabler. He is caught and dropped back at the 42 yard line. They don't make it to the ball. Curtis Johnson made the tackle. The Notre Dame defense really stuck it to Mr. Hubbard that time. He fumbled the ball. Stabler picked it up back deep in his own territory, trying to run it out, and Johnson tackled him back at the 42. The Dolphins take over. And I think Dick Anderson caused the fumble. There's a timeout on the field. Dolphin football will continue in one minute. The score, Miami 20, the Raiders 10. Hubbard, who is noted for fumbling on the Raiders team, was top pretty good on fourth and inches. The ball fumbled. Stabler recovered, tried to run it out. Curtis Johnson dropped him for a big loss, and the Dolphins hold on down, take over at the Raider 42. Warfield goes in motion to the far side of the field. Here's the handoff. The counter to Zonka booms his way across the right side and gets down to the 39-yard line. That play by the Dolphin defense in forcing the fumble and by Curtis Johnson and dropping Stabler so that he did not get the yardage that he needed just uh, could be the main factor and the deciding factor in this ballgame. The ball at the Raider 39. Clock moving with 5.30 to go. A second down and seven for the Dolphins. Morris and Zonka, the split back. Miami leads 20 to 10. Branding down towards Super Bowl eight, their third consecutive appearance. Here's the handoff to Morris. Sweep to the left side. He gets the corner turn to the 35. Out of bounds at the 30-yard line. First for Morris. Achieves the first down. Miami has a first down at the Oakland 30-yard line. Moving from our left to our right. Five minutes and 14 seconds. Left to go, trying to put it away. The Dolphins lead 20 to 10. Here's the handoff. Zonka hits the right side, and he is hit in turn. He was really creamed for a loss of a yard by Bubba Smith. 4.48 to go. Dolphins very much in command now. A second and 11 at the Raider 31. Here is the handoff. Morris outside of the near side. Turns the corner, 25. Gets a block to the 20. Down to the 15, and is run out of bounds at the 15. Raiders at the, the uh, Dolphins at the Raider 15-yard line. Warfield to the far side, fully to the near side. Kick and Zonka to split back. First down Miami from the Raider 15. Hand off the kick, hits the middle behind Zonka. Booms his way down to the 10-yard line. Jim kick. And the ball at the Raider 10, second down and five. Clock moving with 3.49 to go. Dolphins lead 20 to 10. They need to get to the five for first down. 10 yards to go for a score. Receive. Hands off, here is kick, finds a hole on the right side, booms his way down to about the five-yard line. If not, that'll be close to a first down. And Fleming is in the ball game now to give the uh, additional blocking up front. It's his third down, less than a yard to go for a first down at the five-and-a-half-yard line. On the snap, hand off to Zonka, pounds the right side. He's got the first down down to about the four-yard line. Larry Zonka over the right side, first and goal for Miami at the Raider four-yard line. The fans have had a great opportunity to wave the handkerchiefs and really get involved with his team, and his crowd reaction here this afternoon has been magnificent. There's Zonka over the right side and gets to about the three, and that's all. A second down coming up and three yards to go, and that'll be the two-minute warning. That's the two-minute warning. Dolphin football action continues in one minute. The score, Miami 20, the Raiders 10. The uh, group of fans over on the far side of the field who have a big bed sheet, it looks like, on a pole... It says hanky power on it, and they stand up every once in a while and wave it around, which is certainly the indication of fan involvement and has become the most famous tradition as far as fans are concerned in the NFL. More importantly, right here now, the Dolphins, with two minutes to play, have a second-and-goal situation at the Raiders' three-yard line. Kick and Zonka out of back. Mandich and Fleming remain the two tight ends up front for the blocking. Dolphins lead 20-10. to 10. Greasy waits for the snap from center. Here's the handoff over the right side and down at the two-yard line. Jim kick. All right, ready to go to work. The Dolphins set in tight. Third and goal from the two-yard line. Kick and Zunker, the split backs in behind Greasy. 
Bob waits for the snap. Here's the handoff. Donk over the left side. Drags the tackler with him. He's in for the touchdown. Touchdown. Carry the tackler one yard with him into the end zone for the score. And the hacker just come out again. Jack Tatum was the man who hit him. But he got a free ride into the end zone. And so Larry Zonka scores his third touchdown of the game. And we get an unsportsmanlike conduct call against the Oakland Raiders. This will be marched off on the kickoff. The uh, penalty will be marched off on the kickoff. Snap, sit down, the kick is up, and it is good. So the Dolphins now lead 27 to 10, and that just about takes it out of reach. With a minute and 49 seconds left to play, we'll pause here for station identification on the Miami Dolphins football network. Okay, this is Rick Weaver back at the Orange Ball, and this unsportsmanlike conduct penalty is going to be assessed against the Raiders on this kickoff, so the kickoff will occur from the Oakland 45-yard line. That drive, 42 yards, 11 plays. Zonka scores his third touchdown in a two-yard run. All right, Smith and Davis are back as the deep men as Garrow will kick off from the Raider 45-yard line following that unsportsmanlike conduct call on Oakland. Here's a kick. He will kick it out of sight. Out of the end zone, there will be no run back. The touchback, and the Raiders will put the ball in play from their 20-yard line with a minute and 49 seconds to go. So the Raiders, who are out of this ball game, trailing by 17 points, a minute and 49 seconds to play. Stabler goes back to throw. Fires out to the near side. It is caught by Charlie Smith at the 28, and he's going to be contained right there at the 28-yard line by Doug Swift. Pick up of seven yards on the pass completion. That'll bring up the second down and three. A minute 25 to go. Back to throw as Stabler sets up, fires across the middle. Intercepted! Bob Matheson, 30, 35, 20, 15. Out of the 10, he's out of bounds at the Raiders' 10 yard line. Ken Stabler made the tackle. I believe. Matheson picked it up, and the Dolphins have the ball with a first down at the Raider 10. And Bob Matheson is bringing that ball to the sideline with him. He's not going to let anybody have that one. Matheson picked it off the pass intended for Ciani. Ciani uh, trailed him down the sideline, but Stabler is the man who knocked him out. And here comes the Dolphins' number one offensive line out. What a job they have done this afternoon. They have really controlled that line of scrimmage, and they deserve the round of applause. They Terrific hand that they are getting from the crowd. Don Nottingham is in at a running back. Jim Kick is the other one. A minute 13 to go. The Dolphins following Matheson's pass interception. Have the ball at the Raider 10-yard line. Miami leads 27 to 10. Waiting for the snap. Here's Bob. He fakes the handoff. Busted play and he falls down with it back at the 15. He was supposed to hand off. And the man he was supposed to hand off to, well, each went in a different direction. So Bob had nothing to do with the ball, but fall on it back at the 15. Here comes kick out and Paul Warfield. The Dolphins are in for the third straight year against the Minnesota Vikings. Second down and uh, 15 to go. Nottingham through a hole in the middle. He's down to the 10. Five down to the three-yard line. Don Nottingham spelling pay dirt. Jack Tatum makes the tackle, and they mark it at the three-yard line. I don't know whether they're going to get another playoff or not. The clock. Now the clock is moving again after being stopped for just a moment. 22 seconds, 20. The ball is at the three. The fans want blood. They want another score. The Dolphins just standing in the huddle, letting the clock run out. The third down and goal from the three-yard line. 11 seconds, 10 seconds. Miami against Minnesota in Super Bowl eight. The players are congratulating each other. Three seconds, two seconds, one second. The Dolphins are in Super Bowl eight with a chance to achieve the record set by the uh, tie the record set for the Green Bay Packers. The only team having won two Super Bowls back to back. And what a ball game they played this afternoon. They control the line of scrimmage. And ironically, both playoff games wind up with the same final score. The final score here, Miami 27, Oakland 10.